Hey. Good goo. Okay, Hyoman on the outside. A little tricky. I'm going to be a bit sensible to start with. I'm not rushing off to anything. Hero would be good though. Could have one of those. I'm allowed one of those. Ah, you on the mine, please. What? Yes, me lord. More work. Ready to work. I want to look after myself this game because things could go very wrong if I play too risky. Because I feel like I'm a million miles away from my next ally at this spot. Definitely feels like there's a larger gap. Yes, me lord. Ready to go then. I will want a scout though. Job's done. Next peon can probably do a scout. That little fella, once he's brought yes, back two lots of wood, can probably build a barracks, or maybe you can build the barracks. Yes, you go have a little scout for me, see what is out there, please. You come down here. Build a barracks there. Try that out for luck. Get one tower here. That looks like a good spot. It's going to hit most places. You're there. Oh, might want that hero. <laughs> might want the hero. Other than that, good so far. Night off. Alter quite late, so neutral hero. I don't know. Is it that late? Maybe not. I don't know. I, I probably jumped the gun a bit there. I don't know if that is a neutral hero. Keep that wood flowing, please. 20 more. What's over here? You've run out of juice already. Arcane Tower, go. It's an orc. So Mr. Blade Master is probably going to go and take all the good spots, possibly. Mountain King is going to be on his own. I might want to transition to rifles fairly early. So as soon as I can build that blacksmith, I'm going to go for it. It looks like my peon got taken out, so I'm going to assume that... Oh dear, someone's left. I'm going to assume that was a blade master, since he's probably the only one that could catch up that quickly. Going to keep on going with these peons. I'm quite packed with peons as it is. But I don't mind overdoing them a little bit so I have enough wood for later on and then probably steam tanks and such and such and such. I'm going to save my bolt in case an enemy hero comes by. See what we've got. This little militia can go back. There's an enemy. I can spot him. So time to go back to be honest. Finish that off with the bolt. Get the experience and then bugger that off because I do not want to fight a dark ranger. Go all the way to the back of the base. I'm not interested in fighting a Dark Ranger right now. Not until I've got enough units to deal with it. <laughs> not my forte. Okay. I should probably tech. I'm going a bit heavy on a, what to build next. Okay, let's move out again. He might be expanding, so I'll keep an eye on him. Get that tech going. Oh, there he is. And he's got a lot of skeletons already. Can take so much damage here. What is it? Yes, Move yes, that out. Just basically yes, ward him off a little bit. Wait for those skeletons to die out a little bit. They don't last forever, you know. They do die. So we'll keep an eye on him. He seems pretty bored at the moment, so he's probably gone off to do green spot down here. So let's have a look. There he is. It's my boy. Uh, I knew he'd do that, so I'm going to have to go and get myself a dust of disappearance. Some hard focus there. Whichever unit gets focused, get the fuck out. Wrong one. Oh, look at him. He would be as stuck as he possibly could be, wouldn't he? Oh, well, well, we'll just trade units then. Fuck it. I'll lose my footman and I'll bring in rifles. 
A bash would be good, but I don't even have it. Ah, oh, that footman is... One, these footmen want to die, don't they? I'm back on you. I'm just going on the uh, units since I know I can get away with it with Matt King. I think Paladin comes next after this, doesn't he? Should probably bring some militia down. I can afford to do it. Oh, great. The enemy's there. I cannot mess around now. Two of them. Not having that. What's Teal up to, eh? Decided what you want to do yet, Teal? Got a lot of wood. Definitely sorted for that. That's no problem. I might not necessarily go Paladin, but he would be good. Especially since I'm closest. I feel a little bit trapped here, because I know there's two of them out there. I don't want to do anything too risky and end up getting ganked and being even further behind. Paladin go. This is the part where you get a couple of scouts out just to see where people are on the map before deciding to take an expansion. Because that's what I want to do. I don't necessarily want an expansion, I just want something to creep. But I'm not doing so until uh, I know it's safe. Oh, there they are. I would... I'm not going to use my bolt yet until after he's done a wind walk. And then we'll go back on him. There we go. Get some solid damage on him. And then he'll wind walk again. And then we move out again. Wait for him again. Unfortunately, I don't have another bolt spare. Flat out, just move back. Got some buddies here. All my militia are coming back again. So that's not going to happen in expansion. Probably not. Let's just hang in there. Need to save the bolt for something good. Because I've only got one left. I guess it's just going to have to be a crappy grunt. And even if I use it on a grunt, I don't think I'm going to get the kill for it. So I don't know about blowing that off. Uh, let's go for some workshops now. Got this guy trapped. That's nice. Go for the tinker thing. Can't remember the name of it. Apologies. It's down and out. Anyone else here? Picking off grunts. Not the easiest units to pick off. Where's that blade master? I want to see where that blade master is. Full focus on the blade master whenever he shows himself, which he's not going to do right now because it looks like they're in that one. They're screwed. They definitely look like they're under a lot of pressure. Ah, there he is. Oh, that was a good crit of you, wasn't it? Fucker. I was just about to heal that. I'm not going to bolt yet. Now's the time. I might be able to get the kill from that. Yes, just about. You can't blow that bolt off too early because then you go and throw everything away. Slowly does it. I'm actually playing a lot more sensibly this game, which is really rare. You won't see that very often, which is probably why things are going quite well. Not to mention my allies seem to be kicking a lot of ass. That's a really good spot for Faggot Night Elf to be in. I mean, we're not in a major threat, but we want to back off a little bit. Just let them come to us. Oh my. Okay, maybe not. I'm just going to go and heal that TC, but I can't really do much. I'm a bit trapped inside here. Oh, look, they're giving up. Bolt to your face. Job done. And that's that. Mortars next, and then tanks when that comes through. So, uh, yeah, I'd say this went pretty well. Pretty damn well. Where's a level 3 for more heals on Mr. TC? His grunt needs it more than his TC, but I want his TC to be as healthy as possible so he doesn't go back, basically. And that's pretty much all she wrote there. Not even sure what's going on over here, but Mr. Undead is having a very good day as well. GG. I think that person leaving really screwed them over. Was it crassive?
pretty dominated that game, that's for sure. Didn't take any unnecessary risks, so a lot more safe and a lot more likely to win. My usual self would be... I did sort of take the risks, but I played smarter this time. I decided to scout with the little militia and stuff like that when going to expand, which is what I was talking about. If you're going to do that sort of thing, put some early scouts just before you're sending your main militia down to expand. That way you can see if an army is just sitting right outside your base, because the last thing you want to do is start off that creep camp and have two armies gank you from behind, whilst you've got the bobs in front of you hitting you. <laughs> you do not want that. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, and comment.